Let us look at another example of using break-even analysis for factory location planning. A sports goods manufacturing company intends to set up a facility to produce badminton rackets. It is considering sites X, Y and Z for this purpose. Cost data for the sites are given in the table below. So three sites X, Y and Z. The fixed cost is given as rupees 50,000 for X, rupees 100,000 for Y and rupees 120,000 for Z. And the variable cost which is for each unit being produced at these facilities is rupees 135 for X, rupees 110 for Y and rupees 120 for Z. Now if the selling price is rupees 300 per racket and the annual demand is 3000, which site would you recommend? So here we have to find out which site out of the three is the most profitable and that site will be recommended. Now to find out the profit we have to find out the difference between the total selling price and the total cost. So here we have the unit selling price and the total number of rackets to be produced. So we can find out the total selling price. We also have the fixed cost and the unit variable cost for each of the sites. So we can find out the cost of producing 3000 units at each of these sites. So that will give us the total cost. And then if we subtract the total cost for each site from the total selling price, we'll get the profit for each of these sites. And the one which is most profitable will be the recommended site. So let us perform these calculations. So first of all, let us find out the total selling price which is common for all the sites. So the total selling price is equal to 3000 units multiplied by 300 rupees which is equal to 900,000 rupees. Now let us find out the total cost. For X it will be 50,000 plus 135 multiplied by 3000 so this will be 50,000 plus 5 threes are 15 1 carry over 3 threes are 9 plus 110 1 carry over 3 ones are 3 plus 1 4 and this is equal to 455 thousand rupees. For Y, 100,000 plus 110 multiplied by 3000. So 100,000 plus 330,000. And this is equal to 430,000 rupees and for Z 120,000 
plus 120 multiplied by 3000 this is equal to 120,000 plus 12 threes are 36 0 0 0 0 and this is equal to 480,000 rupees now here the total selling price is the same for all the three sites so whichever site has the lowest cost will be able to provide the maximum profits so here y has the lowest cost so y will be able to give us the maximum profits so the recommended site is y